Mike Callahan, Dr. FileFinder, and welcome back to our special Butterscotch.com tutorial on the Windows Registry Tips and Tricks. In this segment, we're going to look at the Registry Editor, which is built in part of Windows. So to start that up, we're going to click Start, Run, and then type in REGEDT32 for Reg Edit 32 press enter or click OK and you can see that the registry editor comes up. Now we'll go over just a few of the basics about the registry editor. As you can see it's divided into two panes and the panes are sizable. On the left pane you have all of the keys like H key, current user, and on the right you have all of the values that are associated with each key. Now you can click on File, you can click on Import, and Export, Edit, you can edit a new key, string value, binary value, D word value, multi string value, and so on. You can view the status bar, you can refresh the registry, you can also find and find next. You always need to use the registry editor with caution. Not fear, but caution. The key thing here is that we don't want you to be afraid of the re Windows registry. If you use Windows, the registry can be a huge benefit to you as far as making configuration changes. There are thousands of registry edits spread all over the internet that you can avail yourself of if you at least feel comfortable with going into the registry. The registry editor displays the basic divisions that I showed in part one, H key classes root, H key current user, H key local machine, H key users, and H key current config. So this is the registry editor. Remember that this is a multiple part series and be sure to look for all of the sections.